Sure. Rose rule number six, Joe. No, any, no vampires on the bus, right? Give her a drink. Everybody's giving the day. Let's have a great day. Good days and great days. Let's make sure today's a great one. Got it? All right, we're going to stretch and shoot. Here we go. How are we going to practice? How are we going to practice? Good. Figure it out. Figure it out. Figure it out. Go, go. They'll be switching and passing guys off. Bryce go in front of the big guy, and he shakes the chin, Joey. They roll in front of him. So now they run out of numbers. Right, you pull, the pull guy is going to be tough. Right, now they run out of numbers if Paulie snakes it. So if you go here, right, we're going to just keep winding guys around the clock, snake it. So now, Tuck, you got the decision. Right? All right, just going to whirl it around, drag it, drag it, pull it. Right? Make a decision there. So if you're open, shoot it or drive it. Right, that'll be the play. What's up, Ben? Run that. All right, so you take him over, right? Two up, two back. Alternate, say you'll hit each other. Stay low, stay wide. Good, tuck, pressure him up. Good, 18. Right, old man him up the court, 18. Old oh, man, you're playing like an old man now anyway. Right, be creative. Be creative and attack. Hey! They're eighth in the league in two-point defense. You're going to get there, you're going to get on balance, you're going to go up strong, put the ball in the basket. No different than last game. Good hit. Good hit. If you don't have balance, stop and pivot. Good, Henry. Big boy basketball. You get to the rim, take the ball, put the ball in the basket. Come on, this is where they're really good. Right, right here, this pass, two on one against our guy down here. So good pass, JB. Way to get it to him. Bryce, you got to get to the rim quicker. Drive it. Good, CD. Good pass. Be on the same page, make sure everybody gets the message so we're all running the same thing and looking for the same thing. Last game we were great. We knew when we were looking high low when we pulled on the chin clear. Right, so everybody was all connected doing it, and right? We had like our best offense in a long time. Go hot! Woo! Good screen, Chris! Good screen! Good, come on, Tuck! See, see it! Good, Nate, Tuck! Not now, Tuck, not on this one. Good. Finish it now. Finish it now. Good, AT. Finish it now. Good, finish it now. Come on, Polly. Come on, Polly. Come on, Nate. And solid. Good. Good, bring it in. We're finishing right there, coach. One, two, three. We fight. We will be. What's different about a road trip in terms of how you approach things? I think just trying to get it to a routine. You know, obviously, it's, it's a home game routine. It's different than the road. Uh, game times vary. Uh, tomorrow, this is going to be a late night tip. Uh, so just trying to find that routine where guys know what to expect. Uh, they know we're going to land. They know we're going to have a meal. We could possibly have film. Uh, so you're trying to establish that routine and uh, get to a shoot around tomorrow because it's a later game. You know, you're just trying to get a comfort level uh, and a routine so that they can. Be free and be confident once once game time comes. 30 minutes delayed, behind schedule. Headed to Newark, unfortunately. <laughs> Air traffic control said that we're in for a for a rough ride, so we want to stay safe on the ground. But we'll be in the air shortly, so we'll keep you updated. Traveling, just try to, you know, we will watch practice here and there. We don't do it every trip, but uh, when there's, you know, you just feel like there's extra, I'll watch practice back, and if there's something to uh, something to see that I think this is going to help us tomorrow. If we're staying in the Bulldog on the baseline, and as soon as you get even with him, now he can come off of it. Paulie, that makes sense? Yeah. Right, AT, if you go there, Paulie, you'll have it here. Now, Joe, right, this isn't you, Joe. He's unbelievable at one time into the big. Our other guys need to get in position. Out of third equals what? So 
but we gotta be great in position. Because right now, what's gonna happen? He's either gonna shoot it in, go here, and you gotta dunk it. Because we're over here hanging out with these two guys. So make sure the ball moves, you move, get to position. Because you know we gotta pay attention to the other team's actions, uh, learn personnel, and uh, just get uh, well equipped with what they do, what they like to do. I think guys stay more engaged when they see themselves uh, on the film uh, rather than watching the opponent. And our scout team does a really good job. You know, Coach Emerson and, and Coach O do a really good job of getting those guys organized. So just see ourselves doing it well and making some mistakes. I think both are both are key. So that uh, it's good to make the mistakes today in practice. So they try to avoid making them tomorrow, and then they need to see that hey, the game plan works also, uh, and get some you know a couple clips of that. After he's driving, like as soon as he catches it, tough, 21 D, no straight line, no what. Baseline. So on this closeout, right, these guys that aren't bulldogging are unbelievable at 21D. Right now, Sean, two shoulders coming at you. We should be hot and firing. We can't get beat baselines. Good wall, probably a foul. So this is where they get to the line because you're out of position, out of position, out of position. I have a big focus, especially when it comes to film, because that's when a lot of players and teams get better. That A lot of it comes from film, just paying attention to detail and just the little things. Uh, most of the time, when you're winning or losing. So, yeah, I would say that's a big part of, especially my development. Now we get a close out, downhill, this is great, Chris. Bang, didn't overcomplicate. One dribble, E2, C4, bucket. I watch us, it's uh, more than I watch the other team, to be honest, just I feel like if we didn't get us right and we're solid in what we do, our execution on offense, our principles on defense, uh, we, we've got a chance, and, and I want our guys to feel that way, just be super confident in what we're doing. And obviously the opponent has a game plan and things that they do that we want to take away, but uh, it's more about us. Tonight, that means uh, 11.30, we go 11.30 bed check. Your hometown guys, nobody's in your room. Uh, Rose, we just pretty much hang out. And, uh, sometimes we'll talk about, uh, we'll watch a lot of other games, talk about that, things we see. Uh, sometimes we'll talk about the other opponent, uh, things we need to do. The night before, Game recovery protocol routine. 20 minutes here, and we'll hop in there afterwards. Do you feel this uh, this cold stuff? Does it help when, when you're playing tomorrow night in the grind of a game? Yeah, I definitely think it helps with helps with all of our recovery, um, especially with, with we practiced pretty hard the past two days. So it definitely definitely helps and keeps us feeling fresh for tomorrow. What is life like on the road to the Big East? No, oh, it's tough. Uh, every every place you go, it's packed up. You know, basketball, it's the biggest thing happening on campus on, at each university in our league. And so, uh, you know, it's going to be packed. And, and I think now with the uh, the realignment, like everybody's established and we know who's who. Uh, there's a familiarity now and a lot of respect all the way across the board. So the fans and the student sections, they all come with it uh, with their best banter. And, um, you know, and the teams come with a lot of energy. And so it's uh, it's, it's hard to get road wins on the, on the road in the Big East. It's that energy for 45 minutes, 45 minutes. Come on now. Sam. Get red. First things first. Norm, you jump up to deny him off the screen. And jump this way. Don't accept it. Beat it. You still get middle. Not a great red. Yeah. Yeah, JB. It's huge. You know, you know you have a tough team. If you can go on the road and get wins uh, in this league, you know, everybody's, you know, the coaches are so good. Um, and there's so much pride. There's so much energy at each place you go to. Uh, if you can go on the road and get wins in this league, you, you know, you, you know you're a solid, solid group. Let him come off. He's coming off the shoot. Or one time to the big. Is this one we talked about in film? Yes. When I'm just hanging out here? So I just need to be more worried about the slip, and then whoever is bulldog in 13 is going to is going to be. Okay. This is the first of three straight now. Yeah, I think I think this will be a great test. Just coming out of the last two weeks where we didn't play so well, uh, the Florida game and, and the Georgetown game, and uh, we played okay in the Georgetown game, just not well enough to win. And they played really well, give them credit. Uh, and then coming back in the Creighton game and, and uh, a little more locked in, and, and I think more where we need to be now. You know, can we sustain it? and get uh, consecutive efforts at the same level, uh, consecutive level of engagement to uh, the scouting report and attention to detail that we had against against Creighton. Uh, so just because it happened then doesn't mean you're going to get it again. And so that's what, but that's what you're trying to do. So this would be a great test because uh, they're coming off a loss. They'll have a good, uh, you know, emotional spirit about them, uh, and we've got to be ready for that blow as well. Uh, along with the game plan, there's there's their the energy and the emotion of it. Our time, our time. Good, KB. 
Rewind, hand, rewind, hand, rewind. If one pops out here, close out short, he hadn't shot a three all year. Okay. All right? One, two, three. Family. We fight. Together. We will be. Champions. We are dogs. Shit, baby. Light it up tonight, Sean, Mac. Jordan, you're on. You obviously have some roots here with New Jersey, so we have some people coming to the game. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I got about 50 people coming to the game. <laughs> uh, friends, family, people bought tickets. I, I had reserved tickets for them, so it's going to it's gonna be fun. There's his first appearance on the floor for Jordan Tucker. And he was impressive yesterday. Runs the floor, elevates, got a pretty good handle, touch. You've had the, the journey to getting to this point here where you know, your Rollins will start with the Indiana game. What's life like as a Bulldog? Uh, it's great. You know, I'm glad I get to finally get out there and play with my teammates. You know, it's been a long year, and uh, these games have been growing for me step by step. So just trying to get better every game. This is only my second road trip, and just taking it step by step, like I said before, and uh, focusing on the plane, you know, just visualizing what I'm going to do the game and stuff like that and uh, just getting a good night's sleep uh, the night before. Lowry will give off to Thompson. Here's the three-pointer. That's the way to start your career. Jordan Tucker three. And he looks at the Indiana bench like he hasn't been away. Somebody must have said something to him. What a way to start, huh? Can't do it better than that. Every game, no matter if it's the first game or the last, I, I always get jitters and once I finally get out, get out there and start playing, or when I knock down my first shot, it, it all goes away, and we're just playing basketball. I want to win City Hall, baby. Try to get this win. It's, it's a fight every night. Uh, definitely not what I expected it to be. Every game is a battle uh, in the Big East, and uh, just going forward, you know, they have everyone has great fans, so uh, we're gonna have to be together, um, very connected uh, when we play. It's definitely, I'm still getting a taste of it, you know, especially this is my first road game on the, in, in the Big East, and I'm looking forward to it, especially like the other crowd, the other team, you know, seeing what they're going to bring. It's going to be tough, but I think we can, we're, we're good, like you said, we're not, we haven't played our best basketball yet, and I think we, this could be a run for us that we could do. You know, if you lose a couple, it's not the end of the world. Just being able to bounce back, and uh, I would say it's all about how you respond to things, uh, you know. So um, just being a great teammate and encouraging each other. Yes, sir. I had this side with us all year. Based on the feeling right, or the observation, there's a difference between talking about it and being about it. Verbal commitment versus signing. Because when you sign, you're in it. Everybody's signing, everybody's two feet in, and it's yours, you own it. Right, so make sure that you go out there and they got dogs to deal with and we are on the hunt. You understand? We sign it because it's coming with us and they know we're coming at it. Right? Everybody got that? Right, so you are in. That means you're in together. Tough teams do tough things together. They just lost. It's going to be tough. It ain't going to be easy. They ain't going to get it. Right? But tough teams do tough things we are a tough team. I told you that this morning. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's 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 go. let us go 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 let
Banks it home. Well, you called it that first half. Watch out. They don't put it this way. Oh, I stepped it. Stolen. Miles Plow. Plays it up and in. Five on the shot clock. Baldwin drives. This is the Bronx. And he avoids the charge as he does it, coming through the middle of the lane. My teammates put me in, put me in good positions. Uh, they trusted me. Um, you know, I'm, I'm obviously grateful for them. And you know, felt felt good to get out there and compete. Um, you know, play play in front of a crowd like that. Pretty special night. Um, you know, there's a lot of emotion, a lot of passion from uh, both sides. Um, you know, I think that's the that's that's the neat thing about playing at the Big East. You know, you're gonna get this every night. You know, wherever wherever we're playing in the country, um, whether it's a Tinkle or or you know out here on the East Coast or somewhere else in the Midwest, you're gonna get this kind of energy regardless. How open for three? Yes. Adventure's up though. Exactly. McDermott knocks down that three. each other we play for each other you know it wasn't the outcome we wanted but you know I think if we play with that fight with that energy and you know clean up some things you know we're gonna get the result uh, that we want and Seton gonna walk out with a one point victory it still stinks losing um, you know we want to grow from it learn from it it's definitely definitely a learning experience I grew up here and you know the sun's gonna come tomorrow um, you know it's not the not a not a death sentence you know we're gonna get better and uh, um, keep practicing keep playing and you know hopefully we hit our, hit our peak at the end